So as you can see, this is the hat. This is from Jusobi, Jusobi. And I'm not gonna make a whole video about this because, I mean, it's a hat. There's not much technical. It's, I really like it. It's quite comfortable, quite nice. So in this video, we're gonna be talking, cat just went mental. So in this video, we're gonna be talking about, what are we gonna be talking about in this video? So layers of a lucid dream. Not all lucid dreams are actually created equally. So there are lots of differences in them. You know, you can have one person who thinks they have, they're having a lucid dream, but actually they're not, and they're just having a normal dream in which they think they're lucid dreaming, or they're dreaming about the idea or the topic of lucid dreaming. There are loads of different variations and sort of different things that you can experience. So it's not the case that it's a binary situation. It's not either normally dreaming or lucid. There are, it's a spectrum, okay? And there are various different stages in between these two extremes. So you have dreaming and lucid at uh, either end of the spectrum. And when I say lucid, that isn't the furthest you can go in that direction. That's just to make it easy to understand for you guys. So obviously this, this video here is for beginners. I'm not gonna be talking as if you're already a lucid dreamer. This is gonna be sort of, to sort of give you a background of the whole thing, right? So you've got on one side dreaming normally, and then on the other side of the spectrum, you've got what we'll, for now, we'll call lucid. Okay, you're aware and you're able to control and guide the dream. So, what is the first level? Well, the first level, which is what this video is, is gonna be about, is what we call layer one. Now, technically there is layer zero, but as I said, this is for beginners. We're gonna get into layer zero. I'll probably make another video or something like that for you guys, okay? So layer one is where you're just having a normal dream. You're just dreaming normally. You're not lucid, you're not in control, and you're not aware that it's a dream. So you might notice that something isn't right or something's a little bit strange. You might have that sort of inkling of a feeling towards the end of the, the spectrum on this level, but at this point in time, you're just dreaming. Now, this is where a lot of people get really confused because I'll get comments and emails and I'll see posts on Reddit from people saying things like, was I lucid? Or they'll, they'll describe their dream and they'll say things like, you know, I was walking down the road and something wasn't quite right and there was a weird flying car or something like that. And then I woke up and I looked back and I thought, hmm, that was, that was a bit strange. Now for those people that is not lucid, that is layer one, you're just having a normal dream. So to avoid confusion, layer one is not a lucid state, that is just a normal dream, layer one, normal dream. So a lot of people, and you might be one of these people, I don't know, um, think that they're having a lucid dream if they have a normal dream, layer one, about the topic of lucid dreaming. Okay, this is where it gets a bit confusing. So if you think you're trying to become a lucid dreamer, right? You're trying to learn this skill. So all day, hopefully, or you know, every now and then, you're gonna be reading about lucid dreaming. You're gonna be watching videos like this one. You're gonna be trying to learn about the topic, right? Or the concept of lucid dreaming. And therefore, you're eventually, you're going to dream about lucid dreaming, but not actually be lucid. Does that make sense? So it's very possible and very common to have a dream where you're dreaming about lucid dreaming. Okay, so maybe you, you're walking down the road and you see somebody else reading a book about lucid dreaming. And it's kind of ironic the way your subconscious sort of works like this. Just because you're dreaming about that book, that doesn't mean that you are lucid. It just means that the idea of lucid dreaming is in your mind and you're having a normal, non-lucid, layer one dream about the topic of lucid dreaming. So hopefully that makes sense. And hopefully this clears up a lot of confusion because um, lots of people think that they're having a lucid dream if they have a dream about anything related to lucid dreaming. That's not the case. Okay, so just to clarify the definition again, a lucid dream is one in which you're aware that you're dreaming while you're still dreaming. So you need to be aware, like clearly aware, that the word lucid literally means clear. You need to clearly be aware of the fact that you're in a dream. And when you do have a lucid dream, when you do do this, you'll know about it. Like you won't be able to mistake it for anything else. It will be so clearly different to a normal dream that you'll instantly snap into realization and think, oh wow, okay, this is something different. This is not usual. This is not just a normal dream. So in the next video, we're gonna talk about layer two, which is where things get a bit more interesting. But for now, just try and understand that layer one is a good place to start from. You know, this is where most people start from. You're having a dream. And if you see things like people doing reality checks 
or if you see things like books about lucid dreaming or if you even see people that are teaching you lucid dreaming in your dreams in the layer one stage that's a very good sign that's a good sign because it means that your subconscious mind is taking on the ideas of lucidity it's adopting the beliefs and habits and eventually fairly soon I would say you'll move from layer one to layer two which is going to be talked about in the next video